hexagon okay uh, take out your notebook and draw a hexagon this is the hexagon okay but uh, hexagon can be drawn like this also i show you how a hexagon can be i draw different hexagons for you look here this is also hexagon guys and i will draw some more hexagons for you this is also hexagon this is also hexagon and i'll draw one more for you this is also hexagon guys so these all are hexagon i tell you how, how these all are hexagon but first i we need to write its properties hexagon has six straight sides and six vertices amar wait for a while guys oh okay, that's fine now so hexagon has six vertices and six sides it has six straight edge sides and it has six corners this means six vertices i show you how guys look there this is the first corner this is the first corner second corner corner mean vertex okay 1 2 3 4 5 6 vertices if you look at the sides of this hexagon 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 there are six sides in this hexagon if you look at this hexagon so you can also find six corners or six sides look at six vertices this is 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 so these are six corners and six vertices okay now you can check the sides this is 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 so it has six sides okay now you can check this hexagon also guys 1 2 these are the corners this is also the corner guys it is also the corner this line comes here this side meets uh, on this side this corner at this corner this is also the corner so 1 2 3 4 this is 5 and this is 6 okay and there are six sides 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 okay and look at this hexagon it is also having six corners and six sides one side two side and this is 3 4 5 and 6 if you look at this corners 1 2 3 4 5 6 so there are six corners six vertices so how many vertices are there in hexagon guys yes six and how many sides are there in hexagon very good so this is just for to explain you don't need to draw these all just draw one of the hexagon okay 
and once you complete please let me know so guys you know about the rectangle square triangle circle semicircle pentagon and hexagon can you identify all these shapes now yes or no That's very good. That's mean you are ready to practice now from the book. Once you complete this, we will go to the book and check the practice zone and we will complete these exercises. Because you can identify now different shapes. We have studied different shapes, hexagon, pentagon, semicircle, semicircle, rectangle, triangle and square. We know about the vertices and the sides of all these 2D shapes. These all are 2D shapes. Guys, uh, did you finish it or your, uh, did you finish it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Okay, guys, who did not finish, I'm giving you two minutes, okay? You have only two minutes to complete it. Then I will move uh, to the book. Then we have to do some practice from the book, okay? So you have two minutes to write it. Draw hexagon and write about it. It has six state size and it has six vertices. Until then, I revise the square rectangle or uh, 2D shapes for you guys. We have studied about the square. The square has four vertices and four sides. And in a square, all sides are equal. Rectangle has four vertices, four sides. But in rectangle, only opposite sides are equal. Triangle has three vertices, three sides, okay? And triangle can be in different shape. I have shown you different shapes of all 2D shapes. After triangle, circle. Circle has one side which is curved, which is curved. Circle doesn't have a straight side. And circle does not have any vertex. You cannot find a corner in circle, okay? Because there is only one side. Vertex or corner, uh, when you have vertex or corner, when one side meets another side. So in circle, there is only one side that is curved. So there is no vertex, no corner. In semicircle, semicircle is the half of the circle. Semicircle is the half of the circles and that has two vertices and two sides. One of the side of semicircle is curved and one of the side of semicircle is straight. Okay, again, I repeat for semicircle. Semicircle has two vertex, two sides. Okay, one side is curved and one side is straight. Coming to the pentagon, pentagon has five sides and five vertices, and hexagon has six sides and six vertices. Now, I hope you have finished, right? Can I go to the book now? Yes! Okay, very good. Yes. Very good. Yes. Now I'm going to share the book um, screen with you. And let's just stop sharing this. And come to the book, guys. So we have studied about this guys, semicircle, vertex, two vertex, one curve side, one edge side, you know about the pentagons as well. And look at these pentagons, these all are pentagons, okay? Some, sh some, some shapes I draw for you and some shapes are here, you can see. One, two, three, four, five vertex and five sides, all pentagon have. So these all are pentagons. Coming to the page number 99, you can see the hexagons also. These all are hexagons. Hexagons can also be in a different shapes. You have to find out about the shape on the basis of their properties. On the basis of 
how much so how many sites are there or how many vertices are there so these all are hexagon now guys come to the page number 99 open your books page number 99 we are going to start practice open your book page number 99 open your book page number 99 Page number 99 of your book, guys. Page number 99. I hope you have opened the book, guys. Did you open the book? Yes. 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 Okay, I'm reading the question for you. In practice, yes. zone, in practice zone, there is a question. The question is saying, circle the shape. Okay, circle the shape, which is a semicircle. You have to circle the shape which is a semicircle. So you have to identify which shape here is a semicircle. Guys, tell me, is this yellow shape is a semicircle? Is the yellow one is a semicircle or not? No. 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 This shape is not a semicircle. How do you know, guys? Because you know the semicircle properties. In semicircle, how many sides are there? Yes, guys, tell me how many sides are there in semicircle? There are two sides in the semicircle, right? And you have to tell me how many. Oh, sorry. The screen. Uh, I need to send it, share it again. You need to tell me how many vertices are there in. Oh, okay, again. And how many? How many vertices are there? How many vertices are there in semicircle, guys? Guys, how many vertices are there in semicircle? Yes. Uh, how many? Two. 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 Two vertices, very good. You know the basic property, uh, the, the properties of semicircle that it has two side and two corners. I mean two vertex. So look at this one. This one is having, this is one side, okay? And this is one straight side and this is one straight side. So there are three sides in this circle. So that means that is not semicircle. Come to this one, blue one. Is it a semicircle shape? Yes, guys, tell me, is it a semicircle shape? No. 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 Can you identify which shape is that? Can you identify which shape is that, guys? Guys, you are doing nothing except shouting, except yelling. This is not the good thing. If you do like this, I will write the answer and uh, uh, I will not ask you then. Don't need to shout. I'm going to open the chat. Tell me your answer. 
Can you identify this shape? I'm asking about this below one. Yes, the chat is open. Can you identify this blue one? Can you do identify which shape is that? Yes. Write your answers. Uh -huh. Very good. Amedo, Ajay for Sparrow, Dr. Amjad. Yes, if you identify, you can identify, you have to tell the name then. Muhammad Ashraf Circle. Uh -huh. uh, Muhammad Faru. Spelling is wrong. Saud, very good. Sharif, very good. Okay. So guys, you can identify the chair that is circled. So this is not a semicircle. All right, all right, all right. Now come again. Come to this shape. Look at this shape. Is it a semicircle? Yes, this green one. Is it a semicircle, guys? Yes or no? No. 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 This is not a semicircle. Why? Because in semicircle, you know, there are two sides. One is curved and one is straight. Look here. There, is, there are three sides. One, two, and three. There are three sides. Two are straight and one is curved. Okay. So this is not the semicircle. Now check this maroon one, this red one. Is it a semicircle? Yes or no? Yes, yes or no? No, no, no. Who is saying no? Who is saying no? I want to listen to those students who are saying no. Only those students will speak who are saying no. Okay? Who is saying no? Guys, you are making noise today, so I'm not going to open your mic in whole class now. This is guys semicircle because it has two vertex, one and two, and two sides. One of them is straight and one of it is curved. So you have to draw a circle here. I will draw a circle here. This is I draw a circle here. Now the second question, guys. Complete the table. You have to complete the table. You have to identify that shape and you have to write the name of that shape here. So I'm going to open the chat. Tell me the name of that shape, uh, that shape, guys. Yes, tell me the name of that shape. The spelling must be correct. Chat is open, guys. Uh -huh. Jeffa Adam, Hamido Abdul Rahim, Abdul Rahim Fadi. Mm -hmm, very good. Dr. Amjad, don't repeat your answer. Don't repeat your answer. Omar Sharif Ahmad, very good. Muhammad Faro. Guys, check. Uh, maybe they are wrong. Is it pentagon? Check the vertices. It's written here. That shape has five numbers of sides and that shape has five number of vertices. So you have to write the name of that shape which is having five sides and five vertices. Mm -hmm, very good, Asser. That's perfect guys. You know, or you all know very well that it is Pentagon. It is Pentagon. So you will write here Pentagon. Okay. Very good. 
This is pentagon. This is the answer. Now I'm going to the page number 100. This is page number 100 guys. Caves, page number 100. Come to the page number 100. Now guys, you have to identify that shape. Look at that shape. You have to tell me the name of that shape. You have to write the number of sides of that shape and you also have to write the number of its vertices. Yes guys, can you tell me which shape is that? I'm opening your mic, but the last time I'm giving you a chance, okay? Don't need to shout. Can you identify that shape? Which shape is that? Someone is saying hexagon. The answer is hexagon. How do you know, guys, this is hexagon? you can check the sides. You know that hexagon has six sides and six vertices. Check here. This is one. I'll show you here with the help of that. Look here. One. Two. I am checking the sides and the corners. This is three. I'm checking the sides right now. Three. Four, this is five, and this is six. So these are six sides. And if you check the vertices, look at this. This is one vertex, vertex number two, vertex number three, vertex number four, this is vertex number five, and this is vertex number six. So there are six vertices and six sides so i am going to write here that it has this shape has six vertices this shape has six vertices and it also has six sides and guys you need to write the spelling of that shape if you can identify that shape, I tell you this is hexagon, but you need to show me how to write hexagon. Yes, guys, tell me how to write hexagon. Which chat is open now? How to write the name of that shape, hexagon? Mm -hmm. Hamido, Saud, Saud, your spelling is wrong. Omar, Omar, very good. Suleiman, very good. Very good. So guys, uh, you know the spelling. We have to write here hexagon and that will be H E X A G O N. This is hexagon. All right guys, now coming to the next, what we have to do here. Question number three, identify these shapes then state how many of each type there are. So guys, there are some shapes, you have to identify them, then you have to count them and you have to tell how many triangles are there, how many square are there, how many rectangle are there, how many pentagon are there, how many hexagon are there and how many semicircle are there. So the first one is triangle. So I'm going to open your mic, but you will not shout, okay? Keep silent until I ask you a question. 
Guys, do you want to participate or not? Yes or no? If you want to participate, if you want to participate, listen, if you want to participate in the class, then you have to be keep silent. Until I ask you question, you will not speak. Is that fine? If it, if is that fine, so I'm going to open your mic. I will check for one minute whether you are silent or not. I need no voice from all yes. of you. No voice. No voice. No. No. That's fine. You don't want to participate. So guys, you have to find out how many triangles are there. So I'll start checking the triangle now. So start from this. This doesn't look triangle because one, two, three, four, five. I will check only vertices. That will be easy for me. This is five vertex. Triangle has three vertex. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is six vertex. No, it is not triangle. One, two, and three. It is having three vertex. Look here. One, two, and three. And it is also having three sides. If you look here, sorry. If you look here, you can also see this, there are three sides. This is one, this is two, and this is three. So it is one. Don't need to write it. Look here, are there three vertices? No, one and two, only two vertices. Look here, this is one, two, and this is three. So there are three vertices in this dust. And I will check the sides, one, two, three. So this is also a triangle because it is having three vertex and three sides. So it is two, check this, one, two, three, four. There are four corners, four vertex. So it cannot be triangle, one, two, three, four. There are four vertex, it cannot be triangle. Why it cannot be triangle? Because triangle has three vertex. One, two, three, four, five. It has five vertex, it cannot be triangle. One and two. It has two vertex, it cannot be triangle. Okay, coming to this. One, two, three, four, five, six. It has six vertex, it cannot be triangle. It is one, two, and three. There are three vertex, one, two, and three. There are three sides. That's mean it is a, a triangle. So one, two, and three. That's mean there are three triangle. There are three triangle. So I will write here three. How many triangle are there? There are three triangle. One, two, and three. So I have done it. Do you understand guys? Do you understand how to find out how to count triangle? How to check? Yeah. 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 Three triangle. Mm -hmm. So there are three triangles. You check the properties in the shapes and you check this is one, two, and three. So these are triangle now. Now you have to check for a square. You know a square has four sides and four vertices. So first you will check four sides and four vertices. One, two, three, four. 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 We have to check four sides and four vertices. So guys, do it by yourself and check your answers with me. I'm going to check also, but you have to do it by yourself also. Is this a square? No. One, two, three, four, five. Five vertex. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six vertex. It is also not a square. And this one is triangle. One, two. This is two vertex, not square. One, two, three, four. This is a square. How do we know? It has one, two, three, four vertex. Okay, first property is match. Now check the second property. It has, it, is it having four sides? One, two, three, four. Yes, it is having four sides. 
rectangle also have four sides and four vertices now check whether all sides are equal or not yes all sides are equal so that's mean this is square so this is also one so you can see guys that this is square one now you check here one two three four there are four vertices okay now check the second property of a square are there four sides one two three four yes there are four sides now check the third property is it uh, all sides are equal no this side is shorter and this side is longer all sides are not equal so this cannot be square okay move on there are five vertices it is not a square there are two vertices it is not a square there are six vertices it is also not a square so how many squares are there yes guys how many squares are there square 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 how many square square i am asking how many square are there in the figures in the shapes The answer is only one square. So you will write here. One. Now you have to find out how many rectangles are there. So guys, you know it when we were checking the squares. So there is only one more figure which is having four vertex and four sides, and that is this. Okay. Other is having five or three or of uh, two like this. So this is having four vertex. One, two, three, four. Four sides. One, two, three, four. Second property is also confirmed. Now check the third property. That is only opposite sides are equal. So look at this. this side opposite is this so they both sides are equal this side opposite to this they both sides are also equal so third property is also confirms that's mean this is rectangle so there is only one rectangle so you will write here one Now you have to check for pentagon. For pentagon, mm, okay. Our class time is finished, guys. Uh, we will do pentagon, hexagon, and semicircle in the uh, next class. I hope you understand this. Keep practicing in your home. Uh, enjoy your weekend. Take care. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye sir bye bye sir bye bye sir bye bye